Good morning, everyone. Alexis here. Thank you for joining me for our day's devotion and morning prayer. Today, we want to become from Colossians chapter 3, verse 13. It says, do not become angry with each other. If you think that someone has done something wrong against you, forgive them. Remember that your Lord has forgiven you. So you should always forgive other people. Lord, we just thank you for this word. We thank you for all that you're doing in our lives, God. Grant us the strength to forgive. Give us the courage to let go and move forward, God. We pray that this word does not fall on deaf ears, God, but it penetrates our hearts, our minds, God, that we are set free and delivered in Jesus' name. Amen, amen, amen. All right, guys, so today we're going to come from the topic, let it go. Let it go. So, um, I remember when I was in high school, y'all, and I had completed a paper, right? So, during the paper, I we had a topic, do you think... Um, Obama believes this or this and I knew everybody was going to say the positive so I said you know what let me be different uh, let me say the negative thing and show why because when you have research it doesn't necessarily matter if it's right or wrong um, it just matters if you have the research to back it up so I said let me just pick the negative point so I can do something different so based on the negative comment that I picked my teacher gave me a comment and said that I was making, um, gave me an if basically and said I was making communist uh, comments, right? So I was so upset, you know, because that wasn't my intention. You know, I was just trying to do something different. You know, I was pro Obama and all that and all that, but I was just trying to write something different or whatever. So I called my dad up to the school. Uh, and, and, and you know, explain my point. And he took the if back and gave me a C. But long story short, I had carried that with me. Like, I was so upset for years and years and years now. I graduated years ago, okay? We pe- we celebrated 10 years, uh, maybe 5 years ago. So, maybe 15 years, I was carrying that with me. I was so upset, right? So, then I seen the uh, principal... Well, he's a principal now, but he was a teacher then. I see him, uh, see him, y'all, and I'm still mad about the comment, right? And he's just so happy to see me, and he's just like, I've been following you on Facebook. You're just doing so many great things. I'm so proud of you, so proud of you, so proud of you, da 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 And I saw him, and he had no resentment towards me. And then I saw the load that he was carrying because of the job that he had. You know, um, being a principal is not easy. It's hard. And he just seemed so sad. He just seemed so heavy. He seemed so burdened. And I immediately feel remorse. And I'm like, Lord, I've been carrying this in my spirit all these years. And, you know, on the other end of it, he ain't even mad about it. He like, I'm proud of you. I've been watching you. And I'm just like, you know what, Lex? Let it go. And I felt a release to let they go and how many times do we carry stuff or carry experiences that we had with people that's unnecessary you know what i'm saying instead of taking the lesson instead of taking the blessing instead of taking what we learned from the situation we kind of carry it in our heart saying i don't deal with this person because of that i don't deal with this person because of that but the bible says that when god forgives us he throws it in the sea of unforgiveness for unforgiveness for this basically he doesn't remember it anymore and we are made in his image so we should take on those same characteristics and be like him and walk like him and talk like him and not carry unnecessary pain because i didn't realize it was weighing me down until i released it so our prayer point for today is to let it go whatever we may be thinking about whatever we may be carrying that's unnecessary give us the strength to let it go and god if we don't know what it is reveal it to us today okay guys so that's our thought for today. That's our prayer for today. Lord, we just pray that you give us the strength to let it go, to move forward, to push past the pain, God. Whoever hurt us, whoever disappointed us, whoever gave us a reason to harbor unforgiveness and bitterness, God. Give us the strength to let it go, God. We want to be like you, God. To be like Christ is to forget those things that happened to us, God. Make it easy to forgive, God, because you are 
you easily forgive us, God. We no longer want to carry the burden of hate, the burden of pain, the burden of unforgiveness in our hearts, God. But we want to be set free and delivered, God. We want the weight to lift off of us, Lord. So we thank you because it's already done. We thank you that we can see with new eyes. We thank you that we no longer have bitterness in our hearts, but we are forgiving those who hurt us and offended us. In the name of Jesus, we give you all the praise, the glory, and the honor. Make it easy for us to forgive. In Jesus' name, amen, amen, amen. Y'all go forth, be great. Have a great weekend. I'll see y'all soon. Bye.